our show done and we're back up in a tree tonight we are at the spot of my strike one my first miss here we are back on this cut bean field it's been frigid cold i mean right now it's 30 i think but it's going to drop down to 22 it was really cold during the day today the sun just popped out we got a decoy with us again we're hoping something like last time happens but they come into the decoy this time, so we'll see what happens tonight. Should be fun. about that eight point came out we cannot move though don't move until these deer go away just be a statue yep yep i can already tell it's a big buck yep it's one of the big ones i think it's jumbo I smoked him. I smoked him. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Watch him. You want him?
stay on that spot. Are you on that spot? I think... I think he's down, dude. about that book since we laid eyes on him. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, that is so awesome. Oh my god, Charlie. We did it. We did it. We did it. Oh my god. I, those books came in right here. And I told Charlie, wait, those deer are looking right up at us. And I told Charlie, I think I see a giant don't move, but he's coming in. And then as soon as his frame stepped out, I knew it was him. And he just came in and it was just so absolutely perfect. Like you cannot draw up. You cannot draw up a decoy on any better. Just hammered an Iowa giant. Everything happens for a reason, Charlie. I was absolutely kicking myself for the last like 12 days. Where's dad? Hold up, we're watching your intern show. Hold Where's on. dad? Just, here, we're watching your intern show. I'm, yeah. I'll pass it on. Yeah. Turn it down, it, it's raw. Dad? Okay. Hello? You're on speakerphone. I just shot Chumba. Oh, I knew that's, I just told Dawn, she's like, your phone's ringing. And I'm like, we're like, leave it alone. I'm like, uh, it might be Ross. He always calls when he shoots something. She just he went and got it, and it was you. I knew it. You did. I smoked him. He came in. I sat the same spot. I sat. Remember we were talking to McKinley and yeah. he was saying he yep. thinks it's because you were meant to kill that. <laughs> yeah, McKinley, my friend McKinley said it. Like, he said it like every time I had mentioned these deer, missing these deer, he said it's because you're going to get chumba. Oh, my God. Oh, I can't wait to. Yeah, I know. Like, send me something. Yeah, something I will. I will. <laughs> All right. Good job, man. Thank you. So the story in June, I think it was June or July. July. It was July. Charlie and I went out here and scouted these bean fields in the summer, and we laid eyes on them. And ever since then, we moved a bunch of cameras in here, and we've been following them all season. We got loads of pictures of them. We just never can really figure them out or see them while we're hunting. But we did it. No better time than now. Hey. I just shot Chumba. Shut up. I swear to God, I smoked him. We saw him go down. No way. I swear. Oh my God. It was just absolutely perfect. Where'd you kill him? Where I missed drop time. Same exact stand and everything. Did you have the decoy out? Yep. He came in, decoyed 35 yards, and he's down. God, oh. That is so awesome. Congrats, bud. Thank you. You need us to help him, too. Okay. Yeah. You come out. Oh, Charlie, hold on. There's a big buck in the field. I'm going to give Charlie my bow. I'll be back. You take mine. Set to 35. 35 is, you saw where 
I think there's another deer behind him. That other buck, I bet. <laughs> That's just a fawn. Oh, here comes a spike coming to us. Here he comes. Yeah, he's gonna decoy. So basket. Should I shoot? I don't know. He's a young deer, dude. And he's busted. Nah, I'm gonna pass him. Super excited to introduce to you HHA Custom. We have a variety of different custom Cerakote colors that we will be offering on our Tetra Max Rise lineup. We're extremely excited for this and really excited to bring it to you, the end user. If you have any more questions on the HHA Custom Cerakote lineup, visit your local HHA dealer or hjsports.com. got everything packed up had to take down the set and take the decoy down um mike melissa and brad are on their way out to help so we're gonna track him and recover him and then uh, they should be here any second there he is Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Charlie, what did we just do? Oh. Well, here he is, Chumbawamba. This is the buck Chuck and I have been chasing all year. It's actually the first buck that Chuck and I laid eyes on scouting this summer. We found him in uh, early July. It was right around the 4th of July. We did a hanging scout this summer over a bean field. We had scouted the previous night, and we saw a lot of deer pile into that field, but we didn't really know uh, what the quality of deer were in that bean field. So the next night we did a hanging scout in our saddles, our first sit, and uh, we laid eyes on this buck. It actually 
came out of a swamp and walked 40 yards under our stand. So we knew we were going to be chasing him all year, and we did chase him all year. In the meantime, while we were hunting this buck, I had two incredible encounters. Actually, where I just shot Chumbawamba tonight is where I missed the drop tine buck. The drop tine buck kind of did the same exact thing, came out in the same spot, walked the doe all the way across the field, but he ended up cutting in the timber 40 yards behind us, and I had a tree. So that was strike one for me. Then two days later, Mike was filming me. The night before, I had glassed over a swamp where I knew some deer were bedding. I had laid eyes on a really good buck, which I thought was Chumba. But the next morning, we were sitting there, and a really wide framing nine point, an awesome deer ended up coming and walking 12 yards from us, and I missed that buck, and that was strike two. I was really down on myself because I practice all summer. I do all, put in all the work, the scouting. I know I've had two opportunities at two amazing deer in Iowa, and I was beating myself up over Thanksgiving, but the whole time over Thanksgiving, all my family and friends kept reminding me that this is happening for a reason, and the reason was because Chumba. It's been a blast chasing this deer this year. I'm so grateful to be given an opportunity to come down here as an intern and we didn't even know it coming in that we we're gonna be able to hunt and chase, chase these deer in Iowa this year. And we have been presented with all the tools to, to succeed here. Just uh, learning, I've learned so much throughout this year and to be able to learn as a hunter and chase these deer on public land because I've never hunted public land as well is just an awesome experience and opportunity. We're gonna work on getting this deer quartered up and get them out of here. We got a long hike back and then the party starts. Thank <laughs> you.